you to take me back So tell me, is you gon' ride out when the chips fall? I seen too many people leave when it get hot I'm tired of going back and forth when we pissed off Most of my friends don't went through it and they stood tall See, they gon' try and tell you what they think is good for you Whole time they was plotting, man, I wish they was for you You gotta watch your back, your front, your side, they disloyal you I gotta watch my crown, cause from birth I've been Alright, what's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Nani the Goddess. I'm back with another video. Shout out to my tribe. Y'all already know how we do. Um, a lot of y'all are being hard on yourselves about why you didn't recognize the person for who they were. Um, prior to, I guess, you did something or let them in your home or um, was intimate with them, whatever it was. Um, but Spirit said... Don't be on yourself because that karmic studied you like a mark. Okay? They studied you all. They're still studying you all, I just heard. Um, so let's go ahead and get rocking. Spirit, I ask that you come forth and wrap your arms around me in my collective. I ask that you all continue to protect me as I tap into the energy surrounding my collective. We want to send back some energy spirit. Anybody who's sending us high vibrational energy, love and energy, positive energy spirit. Anything high vibrational, we send it back to them tenfold. Anybody who is sending us low vibrational energy, negative energy, uh, doing un in, uh, uh, doing any <clears throat> excuse me unwanted spell work, um, sending us any dark energy, just blind, backstabbing, betraying us, anything that's low vibrational spirit, we send it back to them tenfold. It's not our energy; don't belong to us. We ask that y'all block that energy and continue to protect us from it. Thank y'all so much. It's already done so much. It be. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's get it cracking because they're already trying to attack my throat shot. I've been going through with that. So let me see. Because I know that um, with Saturn and retrograde, like these karmas are getting their karma. And the divines are getting a shine on them. They don't like it. I'm going to set my timer. So, Spirit, give me the tea surrounding this energy. Spirit said they studied you like a mark. I am really deeply in love with you. Divine intervention protected from the bad. Miracles are happening to you right now. Spirit section. This. No one compares to you. I put you above all the rest. Baby, you're the best. So, this person knows that you all were good to them or that you're a good person in general. But Spirit stepped in. So, if this person goes to you all, you walk away from them, it goes to them. Um, I feel alone in all of this and this one didn't want to go in. I have commitment issues. So, y'all could feel alone in this. And this person is wishy-washy. They don't have commitment issues. I mean, excuse me, they have commitment issues. So... They knew going in, they wasn't trying to commit to you all. It says, I'm being fake towards you, divine feminine, divine masculine. So, yeah, that's why spirit stepped in. That could be y'all that's deeply in love with this person. I'm really selfish. So, spirit's telling y'all to get selfish, okay? AKA self love. This one, spirit kept this one back. I am a karmic. Cannot make it up. This person is selfish. They are karmic. They have commitment issues. It says, I'm planning to propose to you real soon. So this could be something that they say to you all. Listen at it. Listen at it. Look. Cannot make it up. The deans are to let y'all know that that's confirmation. This person is a karmic. They, they don't mean you all any good. I'm trying to manifest you back into my life. So this could be what y'all was trying to do. Or this could be um, what they're actually trying to do. Y'all could have walked away from this person. Or when they walked away from you all, maybe y'all changed the locks. Block them. Um, you're not answering their phone calls or responding to their text messages. Or messages on Facebook or, or social media. I don't think you're good enough for me. And I want to tell you the truth about it. So... This could be how y'all feel and y'all ready to just go ahead and just be honest with this person. But I feel like this is how they felt. Okay. My karmic is pregnant. It is not my baby. So, yeah. Like, 
Now, my divine master, y'all could have messed up and got a karmic pregnant. And maybe y'all met somebody or got that with your divine feminine. And you want to be honest with her about it. Um, she could know. Maybe now that's how she feels. For my divine feminines, <clears throat> I mean, I don't know if this is a karmic masculine or not. Y'all put these people where they go. Because y'all could be the one who is pregnant and y'all are not the karmic. I'm dealing with childhood trauma. So this person is dealing with childhood trauma. I'm going to call the police. I feel like this is this karmic. This part, this karmic may threaten to call the police on your person. Your person could be on like probation or something. Um, or just in general, just to try to get this person locked up. It says I'm a karmic fire sign. I'm doing dark magic on divine masculine, divine feminine. I just heard on both of you all. Uh, so it could be a Leo's, Aries, Sagittarius doing this. I'm going to call the police to steal it bomb. So this could be part of that dark magic that they're doing to you all. Again, um, like I said, don't, you know, y'all, like, we fight our battles differently now because they're going to call the police. I promise you. And that's what they do. I want to be with only you. So this karmic wants to only be with you. Uh, that could even be what they're telling this person. Refusing to let go of divine masculine, divine feminine. Yeah. So this could be what they're doing. Trying to convince and it came back out. Convince this person that, you know, they're who they want to be with. But I really feel like it's your person refusing to let you go. It says I'm dealing with a child support case. So they could have gotten this karmic pregnant. I want some energy on this. Let me get some energy real quick. Yeah, this was a lie. Spirit's protecting y'all from this. Spirit wants y'all to focus on these miracles, these blessings. Okay. Uh -uh. This is a karmic. This is a karmic. The thinking woman is here. This could be you all. Okay, focused on your transformation with that butterfly there. Coming up out of it, you know, recognizing you're that privileged lady, goddess of the moon. That can be y'all um, manifesting the life you want. You know, get more in tune with your spiritual path. We have the twin flame journey here with the woman holding the heart. So, this could also highlight the fact that it's a karmic feminine. This person could be married to this person. Could be a Libra involved. Um... Now, this could be y'all thinking about the fact that y'all are going to have to walk away from this person. But you're looking back to this person because it's your twin flame. Or you've walked away from this person and set sail. Okay. Embracing the fact that you're going to have a replacement for this person. Your person cannot make it up. Adjacent possibilities, financial constraints. Yeah. I feel like y'all are definitely, with that heart, everything I want is in front of y'all. The replacement. Okay. Your divine soulmate is coming in. Somebody who has money. I feel like this person is twin flame is coming in because they, they are in a financial bind. I really do. Yep, I see the garden at the gate at the bottom. Knowing they had y'all waiting for them to commit to do right. Now that y'all walk through this door to personal healing and happiness and focused on fulfilling your emotions or desire, your life force energy, getting that together with that solar plexus, <clears throat> excuse me, chakra there. Here they come. Here they come. But I feel like they're coming with a karmic in tow. Okay, they don't want to let y'all go. The karmic don't want to let them go. And they're not putting up boundaries with the karmic. And I feel like the only reason why they're coming in because y'all did move for it. And they are in a financial bind. And they, even though they know how they feel about you all, yeah, we have family and transformation. Yeah. Even though they know how they feel about you all, they don't even feel like y'all are good enough or didn't feel like y'all were good enough for them. The transformation is still there. Yep, I feel like y'all are both going through this transformation. I cannot make it up. Look. <clears throat> Beauty, happiness, and transformation. Yep. Y'all are embracing y'all selves, your path, your calling, your business, just whatever it is you're doing. Y'all are receiving those messages from spirit. Could be seeing black cats, birds, um, could have dogs or cats. Spirit is telling y'all to protect your prosperity from this person. 
they are going through financial constraints. They're trying to cause it on y'all. Focus on your happiness. Look, that butterfly is following y'all. Put up, put up your boundaries. Put up your boundaries when it comes to this person. Walk away. Y'all walked away for a reason for those of y'all who walked away. Psychic ability. Some of y'all are definitely in tune with your intuition. You're highly intuitive. Okay. Yeah. Some of y'all is being revealed in your dreams. This person could be dreaming about y'all. Some of them could know that you all are, um, yeah, because it could be your twin flame. <clears throat> Some of y'all could live with this person. We have dreams here. Could know this person is trying to come in. They could be losing their home. The dreams card came out. Cannot make it up. Y'all are following y'all dreams. Some of y'all could have just got a new home, new friends, but this could be a friend. Okay, it doesn't have to be romantically. This could be a so-called friend. Um, who is pretending to be your friend, but really and truthfully, you know, like they divinely got them in place into your life, but really, okay, they're not. Really, they are common and they're jealous of you. And they don't, they, they're in competition with you. They don't even think that you're good enough. Yeah, happiness has come out again. They see that you are happy, cannot make it up. They see that y'all are happy. It says, I am aware that being happy means that I'm on the right path. They see y'all are being, that y'all are happy in real life. Y'all putting that work. Y'all prosperity is coming in. Y'all looking good, smelling good. Look like a lonely card. Cannot make it up. Loneliness. I know that I'm never alone. Yeah, that's what they want for y'all though. Y'all are seeing that. The card flipped over. Y'all are seeing that. They don't, they want, yep, empathy. Yeah. Some of y'all could be empaths. I am open to seeing both sides of a situation. So even though y'all are single, some of y'all like to just be that y'all are single. Some of y'all may be single, but y'all are happy. And y'all are empathetic. Y'all not worried about it. Y'all could even have made peace with a separation from somebody. And somebody could, yep, cannot make it up. They're jealous. They're envious. Some of them could be sending y'all the evil eye. Balance and perseverance. They love to attack the crown chakra, those karmics. Could be definitely a Libra involved somewhere, but this could be y'all trying to balance it out. So if y'all live with this person and live around this energy, y'all could be trying to just wait out when y'all could leave. Could be dreaming about, you know, when you could leave. Um, things that are being hid from y'all could be being revealed in your dreams. It says I'm the same as everybody, with but with different challenges. I bring a state of perfect harmony into my world and I do so without judgment. So it could be uh, a court case here. It could definitely be a divorce going on um, or a child support case for real because it did come out, I believe. Um, yeah, my karmic is Pergo. It's not my baby. I'm dealing with a child support case. So this karmic could have put a baby on this person. Okay. And now I want child support. Perseverance. I know that I can do whatever I set my mind to. Okay. They want y'all to stay. They want y'all to stay. They're envious of you all moving forward and, 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 and having a better life without them. Okay? Failure. I understand the mistake. It's only opportunity to learn. That's where y'all are at with it. I don't feel like y'all studying this. I don't feel like y'all studying this. Nah, I want to get some more. Um, let me see. I'm going to put some terror on Let's see what's going on. Because this is crazy. I feel like y'all are seeing it. And I feel like y'all just say, hey, look, you a karmic. Okay, you low vibrational, you toxic, whatever. I'm just going to release you. Yeah, you XYZ to me. Or we've known each other XYZ amount of years. So what? Like you doing too much? You got a whole baby. Somebody putting a whole baby on uh, on you. Yeah, some of y'all are coming out of that energy. With that four swords, um, I feel like somebody was in the head. Five of cups. Yeah, in a feelings too. Nine of pentacles. Yeah, look, look, and he's cutting her hair. Nine of pentacles. So my thing of it is, they don't like the child is single, looking good, smelling good. They're trying to find a way to bog y'all down. I'm trying to tell you. Three of Swords. Look. Look. Cannot make it up. 
Seven of Cups. They broke your heart from these options. They was trying to sit here, and I feel like they still have these options. I don't feel like somebody cannot make it up. I cannot make it up. I cannot make it up. The Nine of Pentacles came back out. With the Two of Pentacles. With the Two of Swords. Okay. This person is <clears throat> blocking this connection out. Like, they're not emotionally available. They're not honest. They're not even making a choice. It could be between a air sign and an earth sign. Or a water sign. Okay? This, this water sign could have left this person out in the cold. And this air sign, or you could be the air sign. Or y'all both could be air sign. I don't know. But somebody broke somebody hard and left somebody alone. Out in the cold. And they know they did. And this person is 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 single, doing their own thing. Could, like I said, be an entrepreneur, a business owner. You know what I'm saying? Getting their money right. And this person juggled them for a Jezebel type of energy. And did not make a decision. And y'all could have this person blocked because this, this man is balling up. He's trying to figure out, I guess, what to say with this page of cups. You know, he want to come in with his love offer, but he wants it to be just right. But all he can think about, he's sitting there thinking about her or him. I'm going to say her because he's a man with somebody else. Yeah, fool's energy, honey. It could be an Aries involved. This is what this person want to do. This could also be what this person is um, keeping from you. That they want to stay single. Okay? This person could really want to be single. <clears throat> this is why they in and out. Strip car could be a Leo. Okay? This is why they're in and out. Did I pull this deck already? No. Uh-uh. Let me pull and see. Yeah. That or the person who they were sitting there um, cheating on you with or walked away from you with or thought was better than you. That person didn't think they was good enough for them. Okay? And walked away from them. Unrequited love. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. Yeah. So I feel like now that this person has been revealed, I feel like y'all know what's up now. Soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. So this could be a karmic soulmate. Yeah. Attraction and unrequited love. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Like I said, there's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. Yeah. They broke y'all heart. It's like, y'all can still love this person or attracted to this person, but y'all look at them differently. I feel like it's changed. The love has changed between y'all. And I mean, I don't blame you. I don't blame you. Trust, romantic feelings, let your friends help you. This situation is calling for you to have faith. Your feelings are real and worth exploring and ask for and accept support from others. They could be um, getting horrible advice <laughs> from their friends, asking about the connection. Um, this could be y'all asking your friends for advice as well. This could also be our spirit team. We have a treat. It's time to disconnect from the world. Somebody goes to somebody. So some of y'all could be trying to trust the fact because y'all feel like this deep connection. Y'all like, okay, well, the love is real. Engagement. Your love life is descended to a high level of commitment. Some of y'all are engaged to this person, will be engaged to this person, or this person is going to come in to propose new love, a new person to stir your romantic feelings. Meanwhile, I feel like for some of y'all, you've met somebody new. Or you will be meeting somebody new. And see, that's the thing. Some of y'all could be focused on somebody new. Want with somebody new. I'm really in love with somebody else. I am arguing. No, excuse me. I'm tired of arguing and fighting. I know you're stalking me. I am only focused on my money. I am moving on without you. I'm a past life soulmate. Yeah. I think you are a liar. I am really deeply in love with you. 
I know you are divine masculine. I'm a very skilled narcissist. So this could be from a time time to make a decision. I know you're stalking me. Cutting people off. Arguing with karmic about you. So this could be the karmic acknowledging that they, that this masculine is a divine masculine. This could be y'all acknowledging that y'all know this divine masculine is a divine masculine. But here's the set. Um, put it where it goes. Put people where they go. So this could be, you know, my divine masculine. A message to y'all. Trying to make you jealous this year. I think you are too codependent. Haunted by our memories. Trying to figure out my life. And don't feel like it's worth it anymore. This is from my spill at T2. Again, that's been my T1. Okay. Uh-uh. <laughs> I guess I could have it better than that, right? So let's spill that T1. And so anyway, I'm waiting on two to come in the mail. And then the blue deck is say what comment one. It's all available on my Etsy page. I do have to update it though. Um yeah. So y'all don't feel like it's worth it anymore. I feel like y'all trying to figure out y'all life. They could be trying to figure out theirs. But this person is way too codependent. They need they really just need a place to stay. That's what's going on here. Yep, it came back out. So they could be coming in trying to act like they are for you. It says the karmic studied you like a mark. Karmic or karmics and I are fighting. Y'all could be fighting and arguing with this person or this could be them with their karmics. I'm tired of arguing and fighting. Y'all frustrated. I plan on coming back. No. So they could be arguing and definitely fighting with this karmic and now they want to come back. They could have went to the karmic because they need a place to stay. Because y'all could have cut this person off because they was juggling y'all. No one compares to you. Yeah. They know what's up and it came back up. Yeah. So this could be them leaving a third party situation. Cannot make it up. This could be them. Some of them, yep, and it came back out. I want divorce, divorce court. Um, if they're married, they could definitely be getting a divorce. It came out again. I gossip about you behind your back. If karma could gossip about them, but I'm getting they be talking about y'all. They stuck on y'all. I'm trying to be strong. They stuck on y'all. They're trying to be strong without y'all. Without this connection. They're trying to be strong while dealing with this karma. Because this karma is giving them a run for their money. I'm telling y'all. Looking for a handout from y'all. in it only for the money. Spraying rumors about you and Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine. I know you are protected. Yep, because they've been trying some crazy stuff. Fake Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine. I look for you and everyone. I have my cake and eat it too. Spiritually transmitted diseases. Fake Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine. So let's dig into this because I feel like the only reason this person is coming back is because this person in this karmic is getting a divorce or separate. It could be a karmic air sign here. They ghosted you. Cannot make it up. Cannot make it up. So the karmic um, could have ghosted them. Trying to break your confidence in karmic earth sign. So, you know, they could be the air, karmic air sign. Their person, excuse me, their karmic could be the karmic air, um, earth sign. It could be more than one person. Um, again, this is not just romantically. This could be family, so-called friends, whoever. Ghosted you is still at the bottom. Yeah, they did that to try and control you, to try and break your confidence. Some of them have sexually transmitted diseases. That could be why they ghosted you and haven't come back in yet. Spiritually transmitted diseases, they definitely operate in their lower self, dealing with low vibrational people, um, doing low vibrational things, trying to set you up or trying to set your person up, or both of y'all. Fake karmic friends, so you and or your person can have fake friends, karmic friends around y'all, praying for your downfall. Spirit wanted that to come on out too. Okay, so this could be the karmic praying for y'all downfall, your person, both of them. Um, again, other people. Put these people where they go. Eat the meat, spit out the balls. If it's not your story, don't force it. Enabling divine masculine, divine feminist addictions to keep him or her with me. So for some of y'all, this karmic is doing whatever they feel like it's going to keep this person with them. Okay. So this is crazy. You can proceed. Spirit is telling you keep going. Don't look bad. Be patient. Be optimistic. Rest, rest assured. Everything is falling. Uh-oh. In due time. Everything is falling back to place. Thumbs up. No means no. Within look like 90 days. Six months. 
That's the juice secret of your dreams. Your pride and ego is keeping you stuck. Forget about it. Thumbs up. Yeah. So, if you're trying to manifest something, don't sweat it. Within six months, you're going to have it. Okay? Send it off into the ethers and forget about it. It's coming, baby. Know that. Overall, your future looks bright. Cannot make it up. Spirit say you can proceed to be determined. Okay? So, if you're asking about when some things are going to happen, it's to be determined. Or when this person is going to grow up or come back to you, what have you. To be determined. Believing is receiving, though. Try a different approach. So, don't feel like you want to, you know, receive these demons or what have you. Just cleanse yourself. Spiritual vows, yummy steams, even for the men. Um, get in there and, 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 and go to the facility, get it steamed, or buy the stuff and do it at home. Yes, yep, yes, certainly. So this is true. Within three months, okay? So within three months, I just heard it's going to be revealed to you all. Okay, so pay attention. This is crazy. Spirits are moving forward, y'all. So believe that you're going to receive abundance, high vibration of things, you know, loving things, positive things. Don't, don't focus on this. Because this is a mess. This comment set y'all up. This comment, you know, was watching y'all. And I feel like both now, this comic and their comic is watching y'all. They started you like a mark. So some of these comments, it's how I like to say that some of them want to be y'all. Because like I said, protect yourself. Y'all having sex with this person, most definitely protect yourself. Okay? Because I'm telling y'all, these comments are purposely giving out STDs. So that divine feminines and divine masters can get it because they're like, okay, well, you since you won't let this person go, <laughs> I'm gonna give it to you. You can go take it back to this person, and then yeah, now we all have it, you know, or trying to lock the person in with them. We're not making love anymore. Yeah, some of y'all have already cut this person off, or at least cut them off sexually. I love when it's just the two of us. Do you believe in magic? Definitely some um, dark energy, dark magic going on. You are sent from heaven. This could also highlight the fact this person is trying to manifest y'all back into their life. Okay. And they want to make love. And they want to have sex. I don't have anything to offer. Meanwhile, they don't have anything to offer y'all. Okay. Who got time for that? Nothing. It ain't about the money. You ain't got nothing to offer. I'm trying to find you. So some of y'all could have disappeared on this person, blocked this person out. And they don't know where you all are. You could have even moved. I don't want kids with you. Some of y'all is just like, I don't even want kids with you. I'm trying to find the answers. Some of them could be trying to figure out what to say when they come in. I'm changing how I view love. Okay, this could be things that they have said or will be trying to say to y'all. I'm trying to keep the peace. Okay, this could be them trying to keep the peace between this baby mama, this karmic and y'all. Because we have third party interference from karmic, friends, family, and our ex. Period. Divine timing is at work here. Yeah, this person is, is waking up to what's going on around them. I'm very ambitious, busy all the time. I feel like y'all like, look, I don't have time. <laughs> I don't have time for the madness. I don't have time for the drama. Say the drama for your mama. Okay. Figure that out. I'm very loyal to you. This could be what they're trying to convince you all of, but it's a lie. I'm trying to impress others. That's what they're really doing. That's what they're really doing. So I feel like y'all are more focused on this new love. I feel like y'all are more focused on bringing in other things into your life. Okay, so let's get some of the round of bonus cards. Yeah, you are sick from heaven, but they messing it up. Spirits are paying attention to the signs, honey. Instincts are the message from the inner divine. So that could also highlight the fact they are paying attention to the signs. They are receiving signs as well. But I feel like this is signs for y'all. <laughs> some of y'all could know this person has an STD and full of spiritually transmitted diseases as well. Okay, I'm dealing with somebody who does. Inner child and clearing. Yeah, y'all needing to do some shadow work. This also highlight the fact this person needs to heal their inner child. Allow me to give compassion to that little one. Let me attend to its deepest needs and feelings. Okay, so heal yourself. Uh oh, heal yourself and do the work. Okay, and um, we have with clearing as true offering arises. It becomes easy to let go. You start to trust that more will always arrive. You shift from mind, mind, mind to God's, God's, God's. Such freedom. Okay? So spirits like oh, this energy out that's not for you. Because you got real love coming in. Divine source is the idea that no person, place, or thing is your salvation. Only love itself. Period. Okay? 
okay? Surround yourself with people who truly love you. But individuality, yeah. Every person has their own personalized study plan in this earth school. Honey, because you got a divine counterpart, a divine soulmate, a twin flame, even for some of y'all coming in. Companionship. Giving someone your complete presence is an astonishing gift. And it is. Period. Period. That's what y'all are wanting. Y'all don't have time for this. Y'all don't have time for this. We have liberation. This has all been done for you, not to you. The doubts and the fears still come up. You don't believe in them more than they're you. Period. This is this is y'all are being liberated. Y'all are being freed, honey, from this nonsense. And some of y'all, like I said, this is what's going on with your person. Put people where they go. If it's not you, it's somebody around you, or your person going through this. Courage could be a Leo. Let let me be open to courageously take the steps that are shown. Right? Okay. Somebody is definitely being free from a very heavy energy, a very disgusting energy. This is very nasty. This could be, you know, what your person dealt with. This person messing around on them, getting STDs, coming back, giving it to them, feeling them with spiritually transmitted demons and every essence. And now they're ready to let go. Everything is in excuse me, everything is indeed out of control. And God will hold it all. I can safely let go. Some of y'all could be meditating. You've been called to do so. If not, a lot of y'all are letting go. Y'all are seeing the signs, paying attention to the signs. Or your person is. And y'all are letting go. Period. Period. So let's get some moonology messages. There has been a lot of moon energy at play. Just put some moon, a lot of emotions running high. A lot of things going on. But again, you know, all these, this is a major purge. Be bold and make the first move. Card in the moon. Have faith in your dreams. Okay, these popped off off rip. Wax and crescent moon and card in the moon. Have faith in your dreams, spirit setting, but be bold and make that first move. Clear anything out that is no longer serving you. Anyone out. Don't let your pride get in the way. Full moon in Leo. A fiery climax approaches. Full moon in Aries. Okay. So it could be a little drama because you're trying to do what you want or do what's best for you. Confidence is your key, though, to success, spirit said. Any other message, spirit? The energy is gaining momentum. Wax and moon. Again, don't let your pride get in the way. Any other message, spirit? Okay. Yeah, super moon. Emotions are running high. Okay, so just understand what's going on so you can better navigate these energies. Look at the bigger picture, Spirit said. Full moon and Sagittarius. All right. All right, I love y'all. Y'all stay safe. Y'all got this. Keep your head up. Understand that this person watched y'all. For some of y'all watching y'all, still stalking y'all. So be careful whether this is that karmic person you was dealing with personally or the karmic person they are dealing with, cheating with, whatever. Some of y'all may or may not know. Tune in because you may feel it. So it's time to tap in and find out what's going on, honey. Do what you got to do to make sure you are protected, you are safe. Because these months are on a whole nother level because they don't want to lose. And they view it as competition. Okay? Just, and they're doing crazy stuff. We got STDs here twice. Spiritually transmitted diseases and sexually transmitted diseases. Baby, get that together, honey. Protect yourself. All right, I love y'all. Namaste to me. Y'all love, light, peace, healing, happiness strength all that good stuff right all that good high vibrational stuff all right stay safe y'all till we meet again next time I want you to take me back so tell me is you gonna ride out when the chips fall i seen too many people leave when they get hot i'm tired of going back and forth when we pissed off most of my friends don't went through it and they stood tall see they gonna try and tell you what they think is good for you Whole time they was plotting, man, I wish they was for you You gotta watch your back, your front, your side, they disloyal I gotta watch my crown, cause from birth I've been